Dear students, today I will let you know about Chemist Portal. This portal has been designed in such a way that you will be able to monitor your attendance, you will be able to check your syllabus progression, you will be able to upload and uh, download uh, your tutorial sheets, and uh, you will also be able to check your internal assessments. In addition to these features, you will also be able to provide feedback to the lectures being delivered by your respective teachers. So let us begin. First of all, you need to register as a new student. If you had already registered as a new student, you don't need to re-register again. Once you are registered or you are registering, for registering purpose, what you need to do, you need to put all these details, like you need to put details of institution type, you need to select whether you belong to Polytechnic or ITI sector, you need to select session, you need to select your institute, you need to select your department, you need to provide your credentials like your full name, your father's name, your mother's name, your email ID, like student mobile number, your parents mobile number, your class roll number, your DOB, your gender, your religion, your semester, whether you belong to PWD category or not, you have to select yes or no. You need to put your district, tassil, area and PIN code. Once you click on save option, your details will be sent to your respective HOD. And after verification from your respective HOD, you will get your username and password on your email ID. After you will receive your username and password, you can log in into your account by using your username and password. Both of these links, that is the registration link as well as the link for login will be provided in the video description. And once you will put your username and password in the uh, login link, then you need to click on user type as student and then you need to sign in. Once you sign in, you will see the number of lectures you have attended till date. You will also see the number of feedbacks you have submitted and you will also see the number of classes which you have for today. In the navigation window, you can see a classroom option and on clicking classroom option, you can see four more options over there. One is attendance, timetable, internal assessment and tutorial sheets. You can check your timetable from over here by clicking timetable option and from attendance option, you can check the number of subjects which you have in this semester and uh, you can uh, view the number of lectures you have attended. You can add feedback and you can also check academic plan progression. For example, in subject number third, that is fundamental of electrical engineering. I will click on view option and for this particular student he has not attended lecture number one he is marked as absent by his teacher and for lecture number two he is present and uh, he can add his feedback so for demonstration purpose let me go back to the attendance option and for this particular subject I am adding feedback for lecture number two contents will be shown over there and uh, you will be able to enter your feedback kindly note the feedback entered by you shall be anonymous okay your name or your details will not be visible to the faculty or any of the institution members so point number one is do you agree with the faculty that the above contents and percentage have been taught in the lecture you need to select rating you can give it from one to five five means fully agree and one means you don't agree at all in my case i will select five have you understood the concept of the lecture delivered or are you satisfied with the teaching methodology adopted in the lecture? You need to select either 1, 2, 3, 4 or 5. It will totally depend on you and on your understanding of the lecture. So I will select for example 5 over here. You can put additional remarks over here as well and then you need to click on submit option. Once, yeah, this remarks is optional field but let me put a remark like taught well and then I will click on submit option once you will submit it will go back to the main window I will once again click on student I will sign in I will go to classroom option and then attendance option and then on the same subject I can check whether my feedback has been submitted or not you can check right now it is showing feedback as submitted 
I will once again go to my classroom option, attendance option. You can check the syllabus progression or academic plan progression of the subject as well. Okay, you can check whether the delivery percentage of your syllabus is with respect to the plan or not. It will show whether you are lagging or leading as well. And uh, in this classroom option, you will also get an option of checking your timetable. You can also get an option of your internal assessment and you can also upload and download your tutorial sheets as well. Thank you.